Doug. Every day, and none of them want anything to do with us, Cass. I just want fun! That's it! Just to see what it feels like. Shit, it's almost five o'clock. We've been playing Guess That Dog all damn day. All damn week. All damn millennium. Not like we've got anything else to do, Puri. At least we're trying to use our brains. <sighs> What the hell? What's that? It's my soul purity measurifier. It's reacting to something. Reacting to what? I don't know. The screen is all jittery. God damn it. I have no idea how to tune this thing. Let me have a look. I think. I still don't know what I'm looking at, though. I think we've got a ton of humans coming in. Uh, do you know what to do? Uh, not when there are this many. Last time I did this, there was just Peter. Actually, let's go ask Peter what the hell we're supposed to do. Hey, Peter. What do you two want? What kind of souls are we getting in today? Hmm, well, let's just see here, shall we? Dog, 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 dog. It goes on like this forever. I think there are some humans coming in. Give that to me. Those aren't your regular run-of-the-mill humans. Those are phantoms. See the angry little eyes? Oh, yeah. Cute. Not cute! Phantoms aren't supposed to exist. Their coming here is a goddamn paradox. It would be as if somebody other than God sat on his throne. The whole fabric of Heaven's reality will unravel and we will all die! Sorry, uh, did you just say that we're all gonna die? Shut up! Oh, shit. What the hell do we do? God works in mysterious ways. God works in mysterious way. God would. Shit, of course! Hey, you! Watch your face! Which one are you again? Me! Oh, uh, Cassio! Cassio of Slarity! Yes, good, the fast one. Take these keys and zip over to the vault. There's gonna be a vault guardian there. Ask him to cut the shit and give you an artifact called the Holy Gosh Darn. We're gonna plant it in front of the gate and stop the phantoms. The what? It's an artifact that uh, I don't have time to explain. Just go, goddammit! Wait, I don't think I'm fast enough to- Go! Ooh, yeah, that does not look good.
Yo, yo, yo. What's up, Cass? Asriel? What are you... Wait, if you're here, then that means I'm dead, doesn't it? Oh, god damn it. Chill, Cass. I only reap humans, yo. Nah, I'm here because I need your help with some Lord's work. No thanks, Asriel. I think I'm good. I've been trying to stay away from Lord's work these days. It ain't nothing like that, Kaz. We don't have to kill anyone. Well, probably not. Look, those phantoms that showed up, they might be a tiny little bit my fault. What the hell did you do? What's the deal with those phantoms? A phantom's a soul that ain't supposed to exist, I. Right? Is it mostly my fault that those kids died? Yes. Do we have time to yammer on about it? Hell no. Ah, oh, so you did the killing this time. The point is that none of this biz was supposed to happen. So I'ma grant you the ability to time travel so you have enough time to stop those phantoms from ever showing up in heaven. Cool, right? Fine, I'll try to help, but I'm not as fast as before, just so you know. Oh, oh you Cassiel of speediness. Old Azriel of mortality owes ya. It's Cassiel of celerity, you goddamn it. Oh crap! That was a weird dream. Sheesh. No more honey doodles before. Yo, yo, yo! Whoa! Whoa, what the hell are you doing in my apartment? We're gonna save heaven, remember? Oh, god damn it. Quit bitching and listen to me, yo. See that brand new bling around your neck? It contains a small portion of my power. It'll let you time travel to any moment between 12, which was when you woke up this afternoon, and 6, which was when heaven blew up. Heaven is gonna blow up today, and you've only given me six hours to stop it? It ain't my fault you slept till 12. Great. Give it a whirl. Travel back to 12 o'clock. Wind the timer back to 12. Alright, here we go. See ya earlier. Yeah, it can take a while to get used to traveling through time-space logic like that. Uh, you okay? Yep. Alright, so, you probably noticed the clock only lets you travel in segments of 15 minutes, yo. That's neat and all, but if it ain't cutting it for your time travel needs, you can always press the yellow button to create a timestamp. That's just something we in the time traveling biz prefer to call a checkpoint, cause we're fancy like that. So try it out, yo. Create a timestamp. Nice. Now, let's just wait a few seconds and... Okay. Try traveling back to the timestamp you made. It should have shown up as a yellow line on the clock. Nice. You can only have one timestamp at a time for now, but that shouldn't be a big deal. Listen, I'm getting tired talking all this tutorial biz. So I'll be resting inside the clock if you need me. Any idea where we should start? Save heaven and biz? Yeah, Peter said something about an artifact we could use. Him. Aye, sounds like you're. I passed out on the couch while eating honey doodles. Classy, yo. Want coffee? Normally, hells yeah. But It's my other, other p- Oh, not- Oh, 
it's my other, uh, it's my other, 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 other. Gonna brush my teeth. Sure, take your time. Heaven's about to blow up, no biggie. Gonna brush my teeth again. Okay. I should check if this is still valid. Well, 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 if it isn't Cassie Girl out. Tell him you don't have time for his bull feces. What? I can't do that. That's rude. It's fine. Just do it. Guess what I... Just ask, Cass. I know you want to know. Guess what I'm up to, Cass. The cunning biblical eagle creature. Guess what he's up to. Oh, you know, don't you? That's why you aren't asking. Well, ask anyway. Sorry, BEC. Don't have time to talk right now. See? Didn't that feel nice? Now, sometimes you might actually want to talk to somebody, but you might not have time to listen to everything they have to say. Get to the point. Here, let me rewind time so you can try it out. That's a girl out and about. Where are you off to in such a hurry? Hmm? No, Cass. You gotta ask him to get to the point, yo. Or else he's gonna be blabbering again. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get to the point, BEC. Point? What point? I was just gonna tell you about how I used to be the guardian of God's throne. But now, I don't wanna. You're really rude today, Cass. Sorry. Hi. so it might be a good idea to pace yourself with the rudeness sometimes, or else people won't want to talk to you no more. Luckily, you can just turn back time to before you were being a horrible person. You asked me to behave like this. And you better get used to it too, Cass. We ain't got time to sip coffee and chat about the weather all day, you know? We gonna save heaven. We're heroes. Maybe you should get to the point. The point is... Oh, nice. I, I think we're ready to talk to Peter about that artifact. Hey, what's up, B-E-C? You hurt my feelings earlier, Cass. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Okay. Whoa, 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 if it isn't Cassie Girl out and about. Where are you off to in such a hurry, hmm? Ah, uh, hey, biblical eagle creature. I'm on my way to talk to Peter about something. Aren't you gonna ask me what I'm up to? What are you up to, biblical eagle creature? I'm gonna scoop dog shit, Cassiel. Yeah, like I do every goddamn day, because all dogs go to heaven, Cassiel. Every single one. Doesn't matter if it's a good boy or dog Stalin. They all come here and they shit everywhere. You're doing the Lord's work, biblical eagle creature. <laughs> Oh, no, nah, that was biblical. Now I'm just a shitty eagle creature. You literally have eyes on your wings, BEC. What's more biblical than that? Yeah, yeah, I don't feel very biblical. I miss the old days when I did actual Lord's work. Nobody is stupid enough to sit on God's throne nowadays, BEC. So it sort of guards itself. I miss Eve and Adam. They were stupid enough. 
What's even the point of having guardians of the throne if no one is going to try to sit on it? God works in mysterious ways. God works in mysterious ways. Hmm. Listen, I gotta go, okay? You try to enjoy yourself. I just know it's gonna be a shitty day, Cassiel. I can feel it on my beak. What's that up there? That's the teleporter to Helheim. They used to make burning swords and stuff for us back in the day. Oh, yeah. They do that for Satan, too. Yeah, we sure love our swords. Can't go there for free. What the hell is up with humans and taking all the good names for dating apps for angels? Stupid humans. And it doesn't stop there either, dude. They've got two apps with flame-related names, so there goes the dating app for demons, and one named after the thing you do with your teeth when you're cold, so there goes the one for Helheim. It's a goddamn mess. Damn. But two can play at that game, which is why I decided to name my app something that would be perfect on Earth. Well? Okay, listen to this. I've called it Tax Billionaires. Oh, that is perfect. Where can I download Tax Billionaires? It's not ready yet. First, we gotta figure out how to bring it to Seraphims, since nobody has invented flameproof cell phones yet. And secondly, we need to figure out how to let real angels swipe. You know, since they don't really have thumbs. I thought you didn't wanna date Seraphims and ring angels. Oh, no, 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 no. Tax Billionaires are open for everyone, dude. And I never said I didn't want to date Seraphims. I just said I would like to know when one is about to show up, so I don't accidentally extinguish them. And Ring Angels? I wouldn't mind that either. Just give me a heads up so I can read up on paperwork fun facts and shit, you know? I know. Anyway, I gotta go and brush my teeth, actually. Haven't done that today. Yeah, I noticed. Well, I'm sorry I'm still healing from the trauma of some old person suddenly showing up in my bathroom, okay? I have to summon the courage to brush my teeth from now on. You know what? Whatever. I'm out of here. Who the hell was that guy? Can't go there for free. Hey, Cass. I was starting to worry you wouldn't show up today. Puriel, you okay? Yeah? Good! Cool! Everything is okay! We're okay! <laughs> uh-huh. Hey, let me look at your soul purity measure fire. Okay. Here. What did you do? Just nothing. Let's play Guess That Dog. Sure. What else are we gonna do? What do you think the next one is? Husky! Aww. What do you think the next one is? Corgi! Aww. What do you think the next one is? Labrador. Aww, what do you think the next one is? Anyway, I gotta go. Okay. Hey, Peter! What? I can't hear a word you're saying. I guess I gotta go inside to talk to him. Hey, Peter, can I borrow the key to the vault? Oh, look, another lazy angel. Which one are you again? Oh, uh, I'm Cassio. And what in the name of Gabriel's extensions are you gonna do with the key to the vault, Cassio? I need the holy gosh darn. The holy gosh darn? What do you think you know about the holy gosh darn? Uh... It's some kind of defense mechanism. Uh-huh. 
So you know nothing, in other words. Get out of here. I'll figure out exactly what it is when I go get it. Come on, Peter, just give me the keys. You're too ignorant to be anywhere near the vault. Now stop bothering me. Some of us actually have work to do. You don't know what the... Ignorant to be anywhere near... Gross! Now what the hell, Angel? It's nothing. Anyway, you were saying? You're too ignorant to be anywhere near the vault. Now stop bothering me. Some of us actually... Which one are you again? I'm Cassiel. And what in the name of Gabriel's extensions are you gonna do with the key to the vault? What in the name of Gabriel's extensions? Very clever! I need the key to go get the holy gosh darn! The holy gosh darn? What do you think you know about the holy gosh darn? Uh... It's an idea. Uh-huh. So you know nothing, in other words. Which one are you again? I'm Cassiel. And what in the name of Gabriel's extension? I'm gonna go get the holy gosh darn, Peter! That's why I need the key! The holy gosh darn? What do you think you know about the holy gosh darn? Uh... It's a sword? Uh-huh. So you know nothing, in other words. Get out of here! Which one are you again? I'm Cassiel. And what in the name of Gabriel's... The holy gosh darn! I need the key for the holy gosh darn! Come on, hurry! The holy gosh darn? What do you think you know about the holy gosh darn? Uh... It's some kind of defense mechanism. Uh-huh. So you know nothing, in other words. Get out of here. But Peter... I said stop bothering me. Go figure out what the holy gosh dawn is, yo! <laughs> oh, dog. Dog. Hey, Puri. Hi. Have you ever heard about the Holy Gosh Darn? Of course. Who hasn't? Cass? I've heard about the Holy Goddamn Gosh Darn. I'm just not entirely clear on what it is exactly. The Holy Gosh Darn is an artifact created by the Lord thousands of years ago. According to legend, he needed a perfect creation to show off at the annual God Convention. But, you know, his initial project tried to kill us all, so he had to make something else last minute. But this time, his creation was too perfect. Anyone that looked at it turned into a drooling mess. The convention was a disaster. Just a bunch of gods standing around, losing their minds. So the Lord took the artifact back to heaven and locked it inside the vault forever. So that's why Peter wanted to plant it in front of the gate. What's that? Nothing. But you still haven't told me what the hell it is. It's an artifact. I understand that it's an artifact, but what kind of... You don't know either, do you? How the hell would I know? I've never even met God. Ask one of his buddies if you're that curious. One of his buddies, huh? Yeah. What's up with your sudden interest in that thing, anyway? Just trying to learn some history so you'll stop yelling at me for not having heard of things. Anyway, I gotta go. Laters! Alright. Guess I'll play Guess That Dog Alone. Hey, Puri. Hi. Are you sure you don't know what the holy gosh darn is? Just ask someone who knew God. Alright, alright, fine. That area? It's for paying customers only. Hi, BEC. What's up, Cassiel? 
Hey, you used to hang out with the Lord, right? Did he ever tell you what the holy gosh darn is? Of course he did. What is it? What is the holy gosh darn? The holy gosh darn is an artifact created by God. That can... I know it's a goddamn artifact. Just tell me what the hell it is. I was gonna, Cassio, but you know what? I changed my mind. You can figure it out on your own. Well, uh, are you okay? It's nothing. Anyway, where were we? Hey, you used to hang out with the Lord, right? Did he ever tell you what the holy gosh darn is? Of course he did. What is it? What is the holy gosh darn? The holy gosh darn is an artifact created by God that can mesmerize anything that looks at it. When Eve and Adam turned out to be a couple of shitheads, he got kind of embarrassed and decided to create something truly perfect. That's when he decided to paint the holy gosh darn. It's a painting. It's a painting? Huh. All right. Thanks, BEC. Whatever, Cassiel. Hi, BEC. What's up, Cassiel? You wouldn't happen to have a spare key to the vault on you. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I'd like to see the day the Lord entrusts the key to the vault of the shitty eagle creature. No, I scoop dog shit, Cassiel. I have no business in the vault. All right. Thanks, BEC. Yeah, yeah. I like to come out here in the evening to look at the river. The scenery is so silent, so serene, so magical. The milk and honey flow like time, and the sweet scent fills the air. Combine it with the smell of garbage and dog pee. And you've got heaven's distinct smell you cannot find anywhere else. The smell of home. Thank you for listening to me, Castle of Celerity. You were always one of the good ones. I'll be taking my leave. Remember what's going on? The quest log tells you everything you need to know, Cass. Do you know what I'm supposed to do? Just check your quest log, yo. Always one of the good ones. I'll be taking my leave.
can't go there for free. You wouldn't happen to have a spare key to the vault on you. <laughs> Never mind. See you around, BEC. Okay, that was rude. No, this was gonna be. <gasps> hey, Peter. I think I figured out what the holy gosh darn is. That's something you should have known before you bothered me. Now leave me alone! Peter, you're impossible to deal with. Coming in. Hey, Peter. I, I can't hear you, Angel. <laughs> leave me alone. Gotta go inside to talk. Hey, Peter. What do you want? What kind of souls are we getting in today? Hmm, well, let's just hey. see here, shall we? Dog, dog, dog. Whatever. Dog, hey. dog. It goes on like this forever. I think there are some humans coming in. Give that to me. Those aren't your Whatever. regular run-of-the-mill humans. Those are phantoms. See the angry little eyes? Oh, yeah. Cute. Not cute. Phantoms aren't supposed to exist. Their coming here is a goddamn paradox. It would be as if somebody other than God sat on his throne. The whole hey. fabric of heaven's reality will unravel and we will all die. Sorry, uh, did you just say that we're all gonna die? Shut up! Oh, shit. What the hell do we do? God works in mysterious ways. God works in mysterious way. God would. Shit, of course! Hey, you! Watch your face! Which one are you again? Cassiel. Yes, good, the fast one. Take these keys and zip over to the vault. There's gonna be a vault guardian there. Ask him to cut the shit and give you an artifact called the Holy Gosh Darn. We're gonna plant it in front of the gate and stop the phantoms. Yeah, I know. What? Nothing. Never mind. Hey! Take these keys and zip over to the vault. There's gonna be a vault guardian there. Ask him to cut the shit and give you an artifact called the Holy Gosh Darn. We're gonna plant it in front of the gate and stop the phantoms. Yeah, I know. What? Nothing. Never mind. That area is for paying customers only. Hey, what's up, BEC? You hurt my feelings earlier, Cass. I don't want to talk to you anymore. supposed to do again? Check your quest log.
Take these keys and zip over to the vault. There's gonna be a vault guardian there. Ask him to cut the sh- Shit, and give you an artifact called the Holy Gosh Darn. We're gonna plant it in front of the gate and stop the phantoms. Yeah, I know. What? Nothing. Never mind. Huh? <laughs> 